Not long ago, untangling these holiday lights would have been too much for Ed Brown. I was just dragging. I really had no energy. He had blockages in four coronary arteries. Three of them were opened in a bypass operation. Now he feels great. Really? Really great. But the key to Ed's feeling great during the holidays is to manage stress, exercise, and eat right. The main thing I have to watch out for is not to have more than 2,100 milligrams of salt a day. And it can be quite a sodium load uh, with a couple of bad meals. Dr. Margaret Redfield is Ed's cardiologist. She says he's doing very well, but for some people, especially those with significant heart failure, too much salt could land them in the hospital. So when they eat a lot more salt, they will retain more fluid, and that their heart can't handle that, and so the extra fluid can back up in their lungs and make them short of breath and back up in their body and cause swelling, edema, uh, abdominal distension. Dr. Redfield has some tips on how to stay heart healthy during the holidays. Number one, watch your salt. 70% of the salt that we take in is not from the salt shaker. So it's in canned foods or people adding salt when they cook. If you're at a friend's or relative, speak up and ask how much salt is in the food they prepared or tell them ahead of time that you're on a salt-restricted diet. Number two, stick with your recommended exercise routine. If you can't, try to fit in a walk or activity that gets you moving. Number three, don't try to do too much. It's okay to say no. And number four, if you have doctor's appointments during the holidays, keep them. Don't put them off until afterwards. Ed follows these tips and plans to remain heart healthy this holiday season. For Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Vivian Williams.